On June 7th, we are trackside in Rayland, Ohio. Right now, you are watching the Wheeling Lake Erie Local pull a string of loaded hoppers off the Y track in Rayland so it can make a light engine run west to pick up empties in Dillonvale. Welcome to the Valley Line. It has sat pretty much abandoned for 20 years. Until now. With a fracking boom in the Ohio Valley, this old abandoned line gets a new lease on life, providing rail access to be as close to the job site as possible. We catch two GP35-3s cutting through the weeds as they head west to pick up empty hoppers. This being the second train to make the 10 mile run west up the old line. The wheeling in Lake Erie brings the loaded hoppers filled with frack sand to Dillonvale, where from there it is transloaded onto trucks and taken to the job sites. After 111 and 110 hook up to their empties, we watch them pull the string of hoppers from the loading area. And now on its way back east, we watch our train go through a long S-curve as it cuts its way through the valley. Behind me are two houses, and when that horn sounded, an old gentleman walked out of his garage. After the train had passed, he said, that's the first train I've ever seen on those tracks, and I've lived here for 11 years. Watch the train slice through the weeds, 
and will take the empties back to the yard at Mingo. Since the crew is out of time, the loaded hoppers will have to wait and be shoved back to Dillonvale tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Check us out on Facebook to keep up to date on what's happening. This is your editor and narrator Cody. See you next time.